Why are people in USA obsessed about who Taylor Swift is dating? Last two days my entire TikTok feed is about how Taylor was at some football game to meet some guy named Travis. I mean that's great, but do we really need millions of videos to comment on this? I'm European. Short answer, we aren't. Long answer, some people are. Some people are interested in Taylor Swift for the same reason some Brits are insanely interested in what's happening with the royal family. My entire TikTok feed. You just answered your own question. Your algorithm is geared towards you. So let me ask you this, why are you so obsessed with who Taylor Swift is dating? Your TikTok feed? That sounds like a you thing. The some guy named Travis is one of the best players in the league. Think Kate Beckinsale David Beckham. They're trying to grab the eyes of two very separate fan bases, both of whom tend to be obsessive. You know her tour is was? Selling like crazy everywhere on the planet right? It's not only the US where people would care. This is literally what TikTok is for. Oh, you're European? Cool. It's not like Europe has its own celebrity gossip rags and eat up drama all the time. Nope. Not Europe. This is an American thing. 100. Only in America. The same reason that people in the UK are interested in what the royal family is doing. It's not just the US, it's anyone who's a fan of Taylor Swift. They are interested in her life because they are her fans. Are you asking why some people are obsessed with a celebrity's dating life or are you assuming everyone in the US is obsessed? Hard to tell, a lot of Europeans make wild assumptions about the US. I live in Kansas City, and my friends are commenting on the fact that it's hilarious how several records were set around the NFL yesterday, but the headline everywhere is that Taylor Swift went to a game with Travis Kelce's mom. I'm in Ireland on vacation and it's on the radio here as well. Not just Americans it seems lol. Just admit you guys care too. Dear Reddit what is a celebrity? We aren't. The media is. Why are the Europeans so obsessed with who Prince Harry or whoever is marrying? She's this generation's Michael Jackson. Consequently the media shoves cameras in her face and stalks her everywhere she goes. My TikTok feed. So, you're the one who is obsessed. You tell us. Posh Spice, David Beckham. Some people are obsessed. Most people are not. The people who are obsessed are pretty loud about it. I don't believe a single person in here claiming to not know who Taylor Swift is. It's the equivalent to David Beckham dating a Spice Girls. It's pretty big, both are huge starts with completely different followings. Travis Kels is a remarkable athlete, potentially will go down as the best at his position of all time. He's also really fun and charismatic, has a podcast with his brother also a star NFL player and does lots of commercials media appearances. Taylor Swift is the biggest pop star on the planet and honestly needs no introduction. The two are the same age and single, so it's really fun to see two media darlings in the limelight. And she looked so happy watching him play amazingly well yesterday that it's just fun for us. It's only curmudgeonly football fans that get bothered by it. I think it's more that sports fans are interested in who Travis Kels is dating, he and his brother are really good players and even cooler people. Your TikTok feed. Mine is 90 cats and dogs. You have interesting tastes. I have a good friend who lives in the Philippines, and she is obsessed with Taylor Swift more than anybody I know, and so are a lot of her friends there. It's not an American exclusive thing. It's a fan thing, and she happens to be from here and mostly performs here, so obviously, a large portion of her fans are here. The answer is she's just very popular, that's it, has nothing to do with Americans, we're not all the people you see on TikTok, who are just following what's trending. Taylor Swift is an A-list celebrity, so you know. Celebrity gossip and all. Remember when Gerald Piquet and Shakira were coupled? Same sort of thing. 
I have no idea who Taylor Swift is dating, you created your TikTok algorithm. Stop commenting on the videos, lol. Because if we all spend time thinking about Taylor Swift, we won't think about more important things. Chomsky's propaganda model is a pretty good starting point for the answer to this question. Check out manufacturing consent. Why are people in the UK obsessed with royals? So the tabloids didn't go crazy when David Beckham and the Spice Girl got together. I'm sure your country does the same thing with some other random person. We literally spent years listening to news about David Beckham and Posh Spice. Not really limited to Taylor Swift. Celebrities, in general, are gushed over by many people throughout the world. They don't have a royal family so someone needs to be the topic of bland gossip. Because we're all taking bets on how long it will take before Homeboy becomes a song. I literally just had this same thought, like news coverage about this. No hate on Taylor Swift, she's great, but celebrity obsession is fucking weird. Oh sure. If she was dating a Premier League penalty diver baby you would be just full pride I bet. Football is football in America bud. Interested in isn't obsessed. Obsessed means they can't do other activities and tasks because their attention is on this one thing. IDK about that lol most of us could care less what she does, who and when. Not my businesses. I try to predict the title of her breakup song. Because. They tap that too. This is what happens when you don't have a royal family to obsess over. I think it's funny because they both now have tight ends. I am an American and I assure you I could give you the name of 100 different people I interact with on a month-to-month -month basis, and none of them would give a shit who Taylor Swift is dating. Same reason people in the UK chat about the royals. Both kinda met to me, but whatever. Why is everyone in the UK obsessed with who the royal family dates? The answer? Everybody doesn't. Because Taylor Swift is awesome. IDK, I just thought the video of her cheering was cute. It's all bread and circuses pushed by media outlets that would rather cover pop culture bullshit than actual news for fear of offending one group, or another. Taylor Swift has reached stand status originally from the Eminem song by the same name. She has super loyal fans who want to know exactly what's going on with her at all times. This behavior is pretty damn weird and obsessive, but people think if someone is famous we can stalk them lol. I do not know anyone personally who cares. It is just one of those media things. Like how every UK website has non-stop crap about the royal family. I mean it's kinda like asking why are the British so enthralled about the royalty when it's really only a handful of people. As an American, trust me when I say it is a very vocal minority that actually cares about this. To the everyman, we see it just as cringe as you do, and care as little or less. As others said, most people are not. However in this case, we have crossover appeal. A coupling for the ages, steeped in Americana Hollywood and the NFL, America's sweetheart and Super Bowl champion. Rich good looking 30 something and rich good looking 30 something enough to crack its way into even the non tabloid news as the only place I heard about it was on CNN. It's like UK obsession with the royals, but less obsessed and less mean. I haven't heard a single person mention Taylor Swift in real life since she was done messing up traffic around here. Most of us aren't outside of the sort of long running meme that she basically just dates people and breaks up with them for song inspiration as she's one of those celebrities who's known for constantly hopping in and out of relationships. Taylor Swift has a lot of fans so her fans really care about what she is doing. And this is compounded by the fact that she is dating a popular guy not the most popular, though on one of the most popular sports team in the most popular sport in America, everything just get compounded. The only way I could see it crazier is if she was dating a Cowboys quarterback but it's just because the most popular things in America are just building on top of each other. I think if Taylor was dating a hockey player on a small market team, it wouldn't be as crazy.